Concept cars are test or show vehicles that car manufacturers debut at publicized automobile events. They're used to generate interest, market test design responses, and show new or experimental features. Many, if not most, are not meant for production at all. They are unlikely to reach production, but they show the capabilities and direction that the company's development is going in. But if they're not meant for production, what happens to them after their debut has been made? Well, most of the time, they end up being destroyed by the company, dismantled or placed in internal company museums. On the other hand, certainly a very small number end up sold off to wealthy individuals in auction, and either way, they typically end up as interesting footnotes in the company's history or are forgotten altogether. So it is rather easy for a concept car to be lost or forgotten, especially if the concept was debuted a long time ago in sources in another language, or especially in a now defunct automobile manufacturer. The vehicle we're gonna talk about today features two of those three characteristics, and the information about it is scarce. However, before we get there, let's touch on the context of automobile design at the time. On August 2nd, 1955, the Soviet Union declared their intent to launch an artificial satellite into the atmosphere, and this began the space race. The Soviet promise was followed through on October 4th, 1957, when Sputnik 1 became the first satellite to enter orbit. The United States was behind in the space race, and that was reaffirmed. On April 12th, 1961, Soviet cosmonaut Yuri Gagarin aboard spacecraft Vostok 1 became the first man in space. This prompted President John F. Kennedy to declare the goal of the United States to land a man on the moon by the end of the decade, as at that time, that was the next major feat to be accomplished. This tense competitive emphasis on innovation and futuristic ideals embedded itself into the culture of the time. Car design were appropriately affected. Space-esque vehicles were popping up in concept all throughout the 50s and 60s. And that is where this mysterious concept car emerges. On the source I first came across it, it was listed as the 1966 Toyota Concept. This intriguing vehicle appears to be in black and white and features a spaceship type UFO type styling, maybe with white paint, although it's hard to tell given the picture is black and white. Given its futuristic design in the headlights, the shape, the fin down the middle of the bubble-like transparent canopy, and a slick rounded wedge shape, hint at its futuristic styling, inspired by space theming. In further research, a short description popped up on car137.com. Described as made in 1966, but unable to find much more information. The link to color shots is a broken link to japanesenostalgiccar.com. I viewed this as a lead, however, and began exploring further into this website. I discovered this post, GNC Contest, 1965 Toyota EX Dream Car. This post describes this vehicle as listed as the EX Dream Car and debuted at the 1965 Tokyo Motor Show, the 12th to take place. It was apparently a half-scale model and a styling exercise. In exploring the post further, I explored the comments next. Two identified this car, however, as a Nissan, one citing a website, which I did discover, and the other a book where I could not find previews or book availability of this reference. However, the individual who apparently answered correctly to this contest and guessed the 1965 Toyota EX Dream Car popped up in the comments to cite his sources. My Years with Toyota's Design, 1940 to 1973, is a rare book and in Japanese, so I consider this a roadblock as that is not my native language and I do not speak it. I found a listing for the other source mentioned, which was Japanese Show Cars Volume 1, Tokyo Motor Show, 1954-1969. Although also in Japanese, the listing of the source had many of its pages photographed for those who would be interested in purchasing. I was hoping to see pictures of this concept vehicle, but according to the previews at least, I could not find the reference to this vehicle. But now I had a name, or at least a potential name, in the 1965 EX Dream Car. 
But while searching for Dream Car and Toyota, inevitably the Toyota Dream Car art competition comes up. It's an annual competition that Toyota Motor Corporation has issued worldwide where art submissions from children are accepted. I thought maybe there was a link. There could have been a competition in the 1960s that could have resulted in this vehicle's creation, but alas, the current competition is only just over 15 years old, having been started in 2004. It didn't go back far enough to be related. However, I dug further using this name, and although not exact, I found an article on Wikipedia of all places. The article being Toyota Concept Cars from 1935 to 1969. Two listings on this article came up as the 1963 Dream Car model and the 1964 Dream Car. The description of this 1963 Dream Car model doesn't seem to fit based on our picture, but the second one, the 1964 Dream Car, although the description is scant, it does seem to fit. It does seem to further support that it's a Toyota rather than a Nissan, but our years are off again. We now have listings from 1963, 64, 65, and 66. Luckily, on Wikipedia, however, sources have to be cited for giving information, and I was able to trace the source for this claim. It brought me to The Wheel Extended magazine, and an issue from 1987, which was celebrating Toyota's 50-year anniversary in automobile manufacturing. Within this magazine, there was an article, 50 Years of Toyota Concept Cars, by Ryuzo Hoshino. I combed through and found a little bit of information. There in the 1960s section of this magazine, I found a picture of the vehicle in question. It was labeled the dream car exhibited the following year. Right above the listing of the dream car model at the 10th automobile show, 1963. The following year seems to be referring to 1964, the year after the 1963 show, making it the Tokyo Auto Show's 11th year. In reference to the 1963 dream car model, quote, created in full awareness of recent expressway openings with the concept of a running reception room inside a luxurious cabin, end quote. This fits the description and seems to be what the 1963 dream car model is referencing on Wikipedia. However, the following year, presumably 1964, a reference to our mysterious vehicle, quote, the following year, two-seater sports dream car embodied a feeling for speed and further simulated consumer dreams for the future, end quote. Notably in the article, dream car is not capitalized, but it is by the picture, which I found interesting. Later in the 1960s section, bordering on the 1970s, the EX1, 2, and 3s are labeled, but those are noted for 1969 and seem to be different vehicles altogether. The 1965 EX Dream Cars EX portion from JapaneseNostalgicCar.com may be wrong, seeing that the EX is referencing other vehicles and Dream Car is simply the name given in this article. However, I didn't know this for sure, and I decided to check out records for the Tokyo Motor Shows to see what is listed for Toyota's exhibits. In 1963, the 10th Tokyo Motor Show, there is reference to a Toyota Dream Car concept in one description, and in another version of these listings, the Dream Car in in parentheses, Deluxe Limousine. That seems to be the 1963 Dream Car model, and it is corroborated to be in 1963. However, on the Tokyo Motor Show listings, in 1964, there is no Dream Car listing under that name. In 1965, however, it has dream car and in parentheses speed shape, which sounds much more like our vehicle or dream car concept in another listing that actually corroborates it with a picture. Using this information, I decided to search for it by name and year. I found a post on blog.goo.ne.jp by Koyapop. If that name sounds familiar, it was the link from the post of the 1965 EX dream car contest on JapaneseNostalgicCar.com, and whose name appears watermarked on the image. So this is the source for Japanese Nostalgic Cars post. It's listed as a half-scale model and seems to have been photographed in 1968 at some sort of exhibit, although listed at being debuted at the 12th Tokyo Motor Show in 1965. It also, interestingly, seems to be plugged in. On the side of this website, there is a description of this Koya Pop user who seems to be a photographer of cars. 
perhaps a good source. Translating some of these Japanese comments using an internet translation software, speculation involves the picture being taken at a JAMA-sponsored event, of course standing for Japan Automobile Manufacturers Association, in Tokyo. Maybe multiple versions of it exist, says some of the comments, as they say the sizes and colors are different. Now this vehicle is red, and previously it looked like the vehicle was white, although it was difficult to tell being a black and white image. So maybe there are red and white versions? I'm going to draw specific attention to a Koyapop comment. Quote, although not a pedal car, Toyota and Nissan seem to be doing various efforts for children at the manufacturer level these days. I don't know if it will be in time, but, end quote. Now, this is a translation, so not all of that makes sense to me, but Koyapop may be referencing the dream car art competition nowadays in reference to the efforts for children at the manufacturer's level these days. The competition did start in 2004, so this 2009 comment would be relevant, and Koyapop might be aware of that competition. There is another reference to Nissan, however, so maybe this design was part of a Toyota-Nissan children's exhibit. Is that possible? I kept looking, beginning to search using translation softwares to find Japanese language sources. I came across an online magazine article about concept cars, which featured more information. The Dream Car Limo glass canopy model was small and actually in a bubble display, so it wasn't even close to full size. On the other hand, the 1965 prototype is described with a vertical tail, quote, a fairly futuristic design, end quote, and listing that unfortunately there are no documents apparently existing to this day. Basically, it was designed to be very modern and futuristic in the show, perhaps to embody Toyota's current focus on sportiness and futurism. I want to draw attention to something, however. Although this page is translated, I want to draw attention to how dream car or dream is used. Here are some following quotes that I want to draw attention to. It becomes a dream car. Dream car motor show. A dream car exhibited in a transparent dome. American dream style. So when looking at this, dream seems to be a term rather than a title or official name, drawing back to earlier when dream car was not capitalized in those articles. Visiting the Japanese language Wikipedia page for concept car, I found this when translated. In Japan, dream car seems to be another term for concept car. Likely why it's additionally difficult to find information on this vehicle, it's akin to calling the vehicle the 1965 concept car. I did more searching in Japanese and amazingly came across a completely unique picture on Google Images, which took me to Toyota's official Twitter page. I translated the tweet. It was confirming that it was a Toyota in 1965, the 12th Tokyo Motor Show, and it was called the Toyota EX Dream Car Concept, which is basically like saying the Toyota EX is the official name, I believe. It was debuted on some sort of stand, which additionally supports that it was probably not a full-sized vehicle, and definitely seems to be a scale model. This may further support that it might have been a children's exhibit, however, none of the individuals in this photograph seem to be of all that young of an age. I did reach out to Toyota to inquire about this vehicle using a translation software, but have yet to get a reply. This discovery was encouraging, however, and in snapping a close-up of the sign next to this concept car, I sent it to a friend who's able to read Japanese. Unfortunately, although I deeply appreciate his help, little was discovered. I kept searching, trying different Japanese translations, and discovered this site, featuring drawings of concept cars. There our mysterious vehicle was, named 1965 Toyota EX. In translating the description, we further discover that, again, it's a futuristic design, but it's also not a functional model, which maybe goes to support the fact that it was being plugged in in some of those Koyapop images. It further cooperates the year and place of display. In continuing to search, I found another source highlighting the Toyota EX7 concept car, but did reference our mysterious vehicle in the description. It includes a picture and a small description that is red, not white, on the stand. It has an unfamiliar background from all the other images that we've seen of it, and seems to be missing the futuristic headlights. 
In the description of the vehicle, EX seems to mean experiment, which is a fair assumption. It's a one to two and a half scale model and has the name Toyota EX. So I kept looking. I found other stand pictures from what seems to be the original setting and color. And this is where new information sort of ends. Other than a few sites with a few of the same information, I was unable to find anything that would add to the information that we've already built. So that brings us to bringing together all the information we have to have the most thorough description of the concept car that we have discovered. It is the 1965 Toyota EX concept car, also referred to in Japanese as a dream car. It's a scale model concept car mounted on a display stand for the 12th Tokyo Motor Show in 1965. It's a two scale model, either half the size or one and two halves the size, maybe around two meters in total length, which would make it roughly four meters in full size length. There are possibly more than one version of this vehicle, or it was repainted to red when redisplayed in subsequent years. There is no photo evidence of this vehicle confirmed after 1968. It was non-functional, it was a display piece, and it was meant to show futuristic design and required to be plugged in. It was space design inspired, futuristic, and it was not a main exhibit, but one of Toyota's notable exhibits, notable enough to be listed on its Tokyo Motor Show descriptions. Records may very likely be lost, and them and the car are likely destroyed or dismantled in either the late 60s or 1970s. So likely this vehicle was a small Toyota exhibit, not necessarily meant to fully seize the spotlight, but earn further design clout for the Japanese manufacturer. So the legacy of this concept is difficult to nail down. Perhaps it has absolutely no legacy at all, but it does have a similar futuristic design that would follow in Toyota concepts and production vehicles. And although it's clear that this vehicle was never meant for production, as the way the tires are designed would be extremely difficult to be practical, the glass canopy in the event of a rollover or a cracked windshield would be extremely impractical or overly dangerous, and was so small, the design characteristics I truly believe would show through in other Toyota vehicles. And although it is possible that this vehicle has no legacy at all, perhaps this video is a part of that legacy. Some Toyota employees, unnamed and unlisted according to our research, worked on this display piece to show some potential cutting edge and exciting design. And I dedicate this short documentary discovery journey to them. Thank you so much for watching.